Jessica Inouye, but uh, she's going to have a tough job against Eva Pfaff one way or the other. Well, Eva Pfaff really is a very exciting shot maker. We saw her in Brisbane uh, play some great tennis against uh, Chris O'Neill. She's one of the uh, real stars, I think, in the making, really, on the women's uh, circuit. She's got all the shots. She can be just a little casual at times, but uh, may have too much power in this opening match for Inouye. Mm, all right, well, we'll talk about the others in just a moment. First of all, let's uh, get the players on court for our opening match. So, ladies and gentlemen, would you please welcome to the Centre Court at White City players for our opening match here today from West Germany, Eva Pfaff, and from Japan, Etsuko Inui. <laughs> and a warm hand uh, for these two players. Eva Pfaff, of course, uh, quite popular in Australia and quite successful, as we saw last summer, particularly in doubles. Yes, well, she did reach the three uh, finals here in doubles, so uh, she's, her game is very well suited to grass. Sophie Amiak, who we've seen here before but didn't come down last year is now ranked number two in France yes that's not bad is it and uh, she comes up against the number seven seed today in Barbara Potter uh, Barbara Potter the beautiful left-handed serve I felt was a little disappointing last week I think she uh, felt was a, she was a little disappointing in Brisbane I know she was very unhappy with the form yes and uh, we've noticed that she spent long hours on the practice court uh, working on her game so uh, I think we can expect some good form from her today I think Trevor fancut has been giving her a bit of assistance hasn't yes. he with the yes. serve and, and grass court play right okay Okay, Joe Dury, the unlucky player, I feel, in Brisbane against uh, a very attractive American um, veteran. I wonder if she'd mind <laughs> me saying that, Betsy Nagelson, because uh, she's, been, oh, she's been coming to Australia on and off for a lot of years now. In fact, she was in a final of an Australian Open uh, some years yes, back. Yes, and she's won the Australian doubles title, but uh, we saw Betsy uh, play yesterday. She went three sets, defeating Paula Smith, and uh, I thought played pretty well in that match. Uh, Joe Dury, uh, I agree with you there, Gary, about uh, her play in Brisbane. I thought that was easily the best match of the week her semi-final match against Pam Shriver and uh, she's the, the player that I'm really looking to to perform well in this tournament mm -hmm. and uh, I, well that should be a good match. Okay well we'll skip over the uh, the Brisbane doubles uh, wash up for the moment and talk about what I think is going to be for the uh, for the public here in Sydney and on our telecast the match of the day between Mandela Kova and uh, Elizabeth Sayers. Yes well we saw Elizabeth Sayers yesterday very impressive in her first round win over Barbara Jordan and uh, Hannah Manlikova can be a little bit unpredictable and certainly early in the tournament as well. So uh, uh, it's a tough draw for Liz Sayers, but I think she'll go out in an aggressive mood and really feeling that she has an opportunity to perhaps uh, score an upset. OK, I'll let you head uh, off to Thanks, our commentary Gary. position and we'll introduce the players for you in a little more detail as they take the court and begin their warm-up for the first match here today, as I said, in, uh, in ideal uh, conditions. Eva Pfaff from West Germany, as I mentioned, and uh, Itsuko Inui from Japan. Player in the blue skirt here at the northern stand end of the court emerged from the juniors to make her first appearance on the WTA computer in 1980 and has already risen to a world ranking of 18. She was a finalist in two Avon Futures Championship tournaments last year in the United States, winning the title at Nashville, and was a semi-finalist in the overall Futures Championships. She was a quarter-finalist in the Australian and Canadian Open Championships last summer, and a finalist in partnership with Claudia Coda kilsch in all three of the major doubles titles in Australia last summer. This year, she advanced as far as the round of 16 at Wimbledon, was a finalist in the Europa Cup in West Germany, and has beaten players of the calibre in the past 12 months of Hanna Mandlikova, Barbara Potter, Joe Dury, Sylvia Harnaker, and many others. She was a quarter finalist both in singles and doubles in the national Panasonic title in Brisbane just last week. As I said, now ranked 18 in the world and seeded number six for this NSW Building Society Women's Open from West Germany. Eva Pfaff. Her opponent in this match making her first visit to Australia is the daughter of a Tokyo banker. She's coached by a former Japanese Davis Cup player of note in Yun Kuki and in fact is being assisted with uh, her game here in Australia by one of the most popular Australian players of recent time in Ross Case. She turned professional only this year after a promising junior career. She was a quarter finalist 12 months ago 
in the Japan and Asian Open and backed up this year to go all the way and win that title. And she was also recently a semi-finalist both in singles and in doubles at the Borden Classic Tournament in Japan. In the first round of this tournament, she defeated a fellow Japanese player, Nana Sato. From Tokyo, ranked 77 in the world, Etsuko Inui. The umpire for this match in the NSW Building Society Women's Open is Ron Cohn. some entertaining and very discerning people to taste new Petite Delice natural cream cheese for the first time. The Petite Delice is going as fast as I can spread it. It's a good thing it spreads so easily. The French onions. Mm. The French onions prove mm. new flavors. So is this garlic and herb. I've never seen them go so fast. It's as though new Petite Delice. Traditionally French natural cream cheese. Sure to give your next gathering a very entertaining flavor. I can't sell you this salmon. You can get a better salmon than that in Australia. Oh, tell us another one. Hey, I sell all my best Fraser River salmon to John West. He wouldn't touch that with a pike pole. Why? It's a Chinook. A Chinook salmon. Flesh is too coarse. Color's all over the place, not enough oil. So this is the fish John West reject. Right. Don't move. John West, buy the best red and pink salmon in the world, wherever it is. If you made an honest chip, very, very thin, you get a crisp a lot of chip, you get more of them, get more of them, get more of them in. But it's got to be the right chip, it's got to taste the strange. It's, right. it's got to be the crispy chip that folks appreciate. Yeah. It's got to be the honest chip, the one that's very thin. That's a crisp a lot of chip, and you get more of them in. Because it's very, 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 very thin. Arnott's Thin Sliced Chips, light, crisp, and very thin. Missy, now we to serve in the first game. Play. Oh. Oh. Love 15. Well, Ross Case was telling us, Alan, that she does have quite a reasonable serve and volley game. Hits the ball hard. She isn't a baseliner, so she could give Eva Faf quite a workout here in this opening match on centre court this morning. Double fold. Love 30. This will be the first match for her on the centre court, and sometimes that's a nerve-wracking experience. You get off to a loose start because of that. Fifteen thirty. Excellent crowd here today for only the second day of the tournament. As Gary said in the introductions, absolutely oh, ideal oh. conditions at White City. The other piece of news we have is that Terry Holiday has withdrawn due to a slip disc. Her place in the singles draw 15, 40. has been taken by the lucky loser Anne Hendrickson of the United States. Anne's currently ranked 134 on the computer. And she comes from Minnesota. Game, Miss Faf. Miss Faf leads, one game to love, first set. Introducing the new Nissan Bluebird. This is two-litre motoring at its best. Its lines are clean and classic, and on the inside, few can match it for space and comfort. 
Now, with Bluebird's unique high energy system, the balance is complete with outstanding performance and economy. The new Nissan Bluebirds. Total comfort, total power, total balance. At your Nissan dealer now. Oh, no, I shouldn't. I've got a hectic afternoon. We're not drinking wine. We're drinking Maison. From the vine comes the grape. From the grape comes the Maison. Maison. Non-alcoholic sparkling wine. Mm, nice. Light. I won't say no. From the vine comes the grape. From the grape comes the Maison. Maison. No alcohol. So you won't say no. Well, a very good start by Eva Pfaff. Maybe a combination of centre court nerves and a different court surface for Itzko Anui dropping her opening serve. And Eva Pfaff now with a lead of one love. Centre court obviously a lot slower than the outside ones. Fifteen love. She does have a very good ranking, currently 77 in the world, after only turning professional at the start of the year. volley there from Manui after really just popping the ball up. Did well to get out of that point. Advantage with fat. leads two games to love. Not too many problems there for Eva Faf, even though she was taken to deuce. Oh. She's certainly not going to be outgunned by Anui. 
hasn't got the service power of the West German girl. Double fold. Love 15. She's having a few problems with that service at the moment. Already a couple of doubles. Uh, 15 all. She's already sent down three of those, and it does make it difficult to hold your service. Yes, I think she's just a little uh, nervous at the moment. First match on the centre court. Most of them going into the net rather than long. Fifteen forty. She was down that score in the opening game and dropped her serve. Thirty-forty. And that's the double break to Faf. Game, Miss Faf. Three games to love. The risk with powder cleansers is harsh scratching, but Jif puts an end to that. Creamy, smooth Jif has more grease cutters than a powder. All the power to remove stubborn dirt. All the power to get surfaces clean and shiny without harsh scratching. Jif. To prove a point, we're going to turn this towel into a doormat. And once it's really dirty, we're going to get it really clean with Aura. And soft too, because Aura is the only liquid detergent with a built-in fabric softener. It gives you the kind of clean you can really see, plus softness experts can really feel. Aura with fabric softener, much more than just clean. You, me. And Marco. Marco Vermouth. Eva Pfaff is one of the seeded players, had a bye in the first round. Pfaff is the tournament's number six seed. And then he defeated her compatriot Naoko Sato in the opening round at an outside court yesterday. Naoko, one of the tournament's qualifiers. Dirty love. He's being overpowered at the moment. Eva Faf. Yeah. 
40, love. No, he's not able to put the points together. She's played some nice forehand volleys. And being out hit at the moment by the tall West German girl. That again as Faf moves right in, well on top of the net there, and angled that backhand away. So four love in the first set. Very confident start by the West German girl. I know he did play the tournament in Brisbane. She was defeated in the opening round, I think it was by Ann Minter. Anui, as we watch it again, made the penalty for not hitting a good drop shot. Lead first service. She has game point now to get on the scoreboard in the opening set. Big crowd here at White City, certainly giving plenty of encouragement. And that gives it to her. Miss Pap leads four games to one. You think you've got flies? Out here we got more flies in the zipper factory. And big, <laughs> they're big enough to share. So the missus got this can of Mortine fast knocked down, and those flies went down quicker than cold beer in a dust storm. And it's a new formula. Doesn't smell like sheep dip. Good for blowies too. Here's one now. And that was just a baby. Mortine, Australia's fastest fly spray. In 1977, my wife suggested to me that Australians needed a top quality washing powder that was real value for money, so I made it. Now she's asked me to give you more and still make it less expensive than the big fancy ones. Well, here it is, my new formula gows with perborate. That's the ingredient in the most expensive brand. It gently removes most stains and gives you a brighter, fresher wash in hot or cold water. Try my new formula gows and write to me and let me know what you think. 4-1 in the first set with neither Faf leading Etsuko and Nui from Japan on her first trip to Australia. Neither Faf though just far too strong at the moment in the opening set for the Japanese girl. Problems with the Sydney Flyers. Double fold, love fifteen. That's it. 
Eva's first double fault. Playing the drop shot and not, not well, well enough. enough. Now we quickly in with the lob, and uh, she's got a good drop volley on the forehand side. At several of those she's played. Good lob. Oh, that was close, wasn't it? Love 40. It's so a real chance for Anui to get one of those breaks back. And back into this first set. Fifteen forty. lucky for Faf, but that ball was hit so hard. Solid volleying from Faf. Really got a good, strong net game. Does get a little close to the net at times, and we've noticed and they're catching her with a couple of lobs in this game. the right tactics here putting pressure on but that's a good pass from Faf I said she has all the shots oh yes that's the best shot she's hit so far advantage miss you know he I know he's starting to get into the match now starting to get a little bit more confidence and that'll certainly lift it a bit more Fifth opportunity to break back. And she had Faf pinned at love 40. Last first service. I see Eva Faf is teaming up with Pam Schreiber in the doubles, and they are seated number two, Sharon Walsh, whom Pam played with in Brisbane, and will be teaming up with in the final this afternoon, is playing with Billie Jean King in this tournament. Yes. We may see some of that match in our telecast time, depending on the progress of other matches, of course. Very heavy rain in Brisbane prevented it from being played again yesterday. Let's first service.
advantage miss in Owe. Well, perhaps this time, this is the sixth opportunity she's had to break serve. Although on the majority of them, Faf has come up with the strong shot. And again. Mm. Deuce. She gets that first serve in and moves in for the volley. She's just got too much uh, power and penetration for Anui at the moment. Although Anui certainly settling down now and uh, getting over her initial stages of nerves. Well, she's got a very nice forehand pass. She's had some delightful passing shots. Now she just can't seem to win the point on the ad court. And there's the forehand again, gives it to her. Four games to two. And watch this again. And Faf not putting that volley away. And of course, that left the open court there for the forehand winner. So good effort there by Tsuku Anui. Four love down and was really struggling, but she's won the last two games. Sporting milestones today, Billie Jean King's 40th birthday. For those of you that can remember, it's 27 years to the day that the Olympic Games opened in Melbourne. Yes, power plus from Nita Fat. 30 all. She did well to get that one back and stay in the point. Oh, just made yes. it. Didn't have to go that far. 30, 40. Just caught the line. But, uh, about Billy Jean King's birthday, Peter. Great to see her back out in Australia yes. again. She's really been a great Absolutely. person for tennis Let right around the world. It. Each year we wonder, is she going to uh, reappear again? But really, it's great to have her back. Miss Faf. Miss Faf leads five games to two. Look, National's Genius Microwave Oven. No other oven makes cooking this easy. That's why it's called a genius. From National. In some yogurts, the fruit can be rather hard to find. But in ski yogurt, you can see real pieces of fruit. Fruit you can bite into. Fruit you can really taste in that natural, rich, creamy yoghurt that Ski does so well. Pick Ski, the full of fruit yoghurt.
this trusted symbol, the latest breakthrough in pain relief, Solvin. A rapid pain relief tablet with no need to wait for a glass of water. It simply dissolves in your mouth with a clean, fresh taste. Use only as directed and see your doctor if pain persists. Solvin, a pleasant tasting pain reliever that's effective and rapid anywhere, anytime. No need to wait for a glass of water. This is the sign of a new era in pain relief. Solvin. Sixth game, but Faf broke again in the previous one, and she's serving now for the set. Quiet, please. This big crowd still streaming in here at White City. Well, she had the chance. 15 love. Once again, the building society have done an excellent job in promoting the event. They're with us for a number of years now for this tournament. And the crowd showing their appreciation. Chipping that into the corner, a uh, pretty good half volley there on the run from uh, Hanui. Uh, she's showing us that she has got some talent and is a good shot maker. Just can't quite match it with the uh, strength of Faf. Bad luck for her. 30 off. Isn't it frightened to play the lob? Faf gets very close to the net on occasions, and Anui using the lob to good effect, but that one just long. Five games to three. Well, I knew he hanging in there in this set. She was down four love, so on three out of the last four games. Yeah, he's broken Faf twice. She certainly didn't look like doing that earlier in the set when she was totally outplayed, outpowered, outthought out everything. Oh. And she got into the match now. happy with the call either she uh, even though it went her way 
after shaking the head. Produced forehand. Gives a game point for four five. Yes. Get. Advantage with Fab. Set point. Great scrambling there by the Japanese girl. Set either fast. First set, Miss Fast. Six games to three. New balls, please. The advanced Quintrex picture tube inside means a better picture out front. You'll only see it on national. Pro quality shows through, huh? The more I see you. Want to see more? More new TV sets. More going for them. That's national. National Shaw sure puts more into television. The same pro quality that made their video systems famous. I'm national. This is no ordinary security door. This is the B&D Securador. It's all steel locked in grill. Unique triple locking action. Three security hinges. Anti-pick deadlock and exclusive fast locking knob at Fox just about any cunning devil. It's far from ordinary. Steel, triple locking, secure a door. True security. Get a free measure and quote where you buy B and D roller doors. First set to Eva Faf, six three. Now he's certainly playing better in the latter stages of the set. Quiet, please. That's showing the new balls. He's looking up at the sun. Fifteen, love. This court will be no doubt faster again than yesterday after uh, one day's play on it. Conditions 100% better than yesterday. It's bright sunshine and hardly any wind. Fifteen all. Very strong cross breeze was blowing yesterday. From left to right from our elevated camera position. Forty fifteen. 
Holds her opening Again, service of the bat. second set. Miss Pat Reed, one game to love, second set. Gee, Lisa, I'm starving. Ah, what you need is an Uncle Toby's crunchy muesli bar. It's all fruit, rice, oats and wheat toasted together. Mmm. Do Uncle Toby's muesli bars make you swim faster? I don't think so. Then why do you eat them? Because they taste terrific. And my Uncle Toby is a very generous man. To prove a point, we're going to turn this towel into a doormat. And once it's really dirty, we're going to get it really clean with Aura. And soft too, because Aura is the only liquid detergent with a built-in fabric softener. It gives you the kind of clean you can really see, plus softness experts can really feel. Aura with fabric softener, much more than just clean. It's Goanui trailing Love One in the second. Eva Faf took the first set, six games to three. Oh. Oh. A great lunge volley there from Faf. Love 15. Not a great drop shot. Love 30. Faf had no trouble getting in to pick that one up. She's fairly mobile, Eva Faf, for a uh, tall player. Deep second serve. 15 15.30. 15.40. This is how she started off the first set with a lot of service problems. Thirty forty. Now he was able to eradicate most of them by the end of the set, but by then it was too late. Faf getting off to a four love lead. Casually played point there by uh, Faf when Wasn't you said it? it was game point. Advantage miss, you know it. Still, that's the uh, type of player she is. Brilliant shot maker and then can be just a little loose at other times. Chair. Yes. Half volley on the line. Pretty difficult to pick up. Called good. Seemed to skid off the line, yes. perhaps. It certainly kept low. Oh. Double ball. 
Advantage me fat. So the fourth chance for Eva Faf to go to a two-love lead now at the second set. She's missed it. Yes. It was quite a well-placed first serve by Anui there, and she followed it into the net. But the uh, backhand return just too good from Faf. serve. Very nice backhand passing shot there. Well, that was a game Faf I think should have won. She had some opportunities and just was a little loose on uh, some of her game points. One all. 15 love. Good first serves from Eva Faf. Very quickly to 40 love. Forty fifteen. That also a good first serve. Middle of the point though. Now he very quickly into the net. Preen's reputation as the great home slainer happened quite by accident. But Preen's reputation is spotless. Watch how Preen outperforms any trigger brand on oily stains with something trigger brands don't have. Special solvents that dissolve the oily stain and lift it clean away. That's Preen Clean. Quite by accident, Preen is the great unstainer.
what a time to get a headache. Thank goodness Jane has Bex. Thanks. For welcome relief from headache, Bex. Quiet, please. He's got the chalk. Fifteen love. Semi-final of the juniors played outside just a few moments ago. Amanda Brown has had a good win over Jenny Byrne in straight sets. Six love, six one. there. 15 all. This is where you can get into trouble playing drop volleys. You see that one was way too deep. Baff moving in. Diva standing just a bit too upright on that shot. a forehand, wasn't it? Really powerfully struck. Advantage Miss Faf. Yes, well, Eva Faf times the ball so well and uh, the ball really, really travels when she hits it. Makes it look very easy. So again, Anui in trouble on service. She had a great struggle to hold serve in the second game. Miss Faf leads three games to one. Just having a look at the sun. Thirty. 
Lovely controlled half volley initially from Pfaff. And she was ready for the put away volley. Well, now he's played some good lobs and I think a lob would have been the go there as uh, Pfaff was really closing in on the net. Particularly at 15.30. Oh. to uh, break back into the second set. First break point against Faf in the set. National food processor does things others can't. It has eight different functions. My kitchen wouldn't be complete without it. The wine of the Rhineland has been a part of my family's history for quite a few centuries. I am Prince Eduard von Anhalt Dessau. My friends Penfold from Australia have sent me this wine they call Rheinkeller. It is excellent, soft, light, and mellow. It is a romantic wine, and it is a wine in the tradition of the great Rhine wines. <laughs> <laughs> 